until then troll mode is in full effect speaking of trolls the new orleans saints new orleans saints from the big easy started off the season hot two and oh scored like 90 points in the first two games it's the first time they've ever done that since they won the super bowl since they did it back in what 2009 or whatever it was but since then they're on a seven game losing streak since then they just got beat by the carolina panthers last week 23 to 22 since then they have fired their head coach dennis allen after two c and a half seasons so guys way or no way did the New Orleans Saints make a mistake by firing Dennis Allen this early? Saints start off hot, guys, like I said. 2-0. and oh. Scoring 90-some-odd points for the first time since they did it. But since then, starting out 2-0, and oh, they've had a lot of injuries. They've had a lot of injuries. Derek Carr was just out for like six weeks, right? Finally come back. Chris Olave has 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 uh has been in and out of the lineup with with like injury um shepherd is out with an injury the defense has been injured the defense has been playing bad because they're tired but dennis allen gets the axe dennis allen gets the axe what's a mistake way or no way guys this is a way this is the way the New Orleans Saints were blessed with a good coaching quarterback combination in Sean Payton and Drew Brees. They were blessed to win a Super Bowl in Sean Payton's what fourth year, right? Since then, a lot of playoff bursts, but really no success in the postseason. They have been blessed with a lot of good, good things, to be honest. This offseason in June in June in June and July. We're saying if the Saints can just add an edge rusher and Judon or or like Hashan or some or somebody, they could win the South and they can make a deep playoff run. And that team is still intact. They're just injured, right? You cannot predict injuries. I like I know it's not like, you know, out of the realm, but the simple fact of the matter is they made a mistake. This is the way. They made a mistake that they fired Dennis Allen. Since 2022, he has 19 wins. Just last season, they were 9-8, and eight, battling for the uh, for the NFC South title. The ball bounces one way or the other. They are in the playoffs, and they might be the Tampa Bay Buccaneers this season, right? I liked Dennis Allen, and I think the Saints made a good hire in promoting Dennis Allen, but they did not really give him enough, enough time. They didn't really give him enough time this season to potentially turn things around. This is a way. They definitely messed up. So, guys, in the comments below, way or no way, did the Saints make a mistake by firing Dennis Allen? Hey, if I wanted you to get preached and I would call my ex-wife, what are you even talking about? <laughs> John says no way. No way. He has a losing record for the Saints. I don't think... I think he might be one game above 5,500, but John says no way. Derek says, I apologize for bringing that offense. I don't know what you're talking about, talk, talk, talking about Derek. <laughs> what? John says they have to shake it up. Be sellers. Who from the Saints would you want to buy, though? If you are a team in the NFL, who from the Saints are you wanting? Are you wanting Chris Ove? Injury prone himself. I believe he got carted off with the with the concussion, right? Are you looking for to bring Derek Carr back to Vegas? Are like are you looking for like a Cam Jordan or uh, uh Carl Granderson, Tyron Matthew? Like who would you sell like like at this point? The Saints in general are a very old team, and they keep kicking the salary cap thing down the road, down the road, down the road. At some point it's going to catch up to him. I think it's going to catch up to him to them now. And that's why you need a coach like Dennis Allen that can develop this young talent. I don't, I don't know. I just, I, I think it's tough. Like, like, who do you sell? Alvin Kamara just signed a two-year, $40 million deal, $60 million deal. Is it Cedric Wilson? Like, I, like who do you sell? Who do, who do you sell? Kevin says what? 
Tevin and I are agreeing on this, and it seems weird. I think we both might be wrong, Kev, Kevin. Well, one of us is wrong. <laughs> Laura says, no way. Get him out of town. Two and seven, seven game lo losing streak is unacceptable. Uh, I don't know. <laughs> Thank him then. <laughs> James Frank says, no way, dude. Dennis Allen should have been fired. So, James, if Dennis Allen sh should have should have been fired, shouldn't Kevin Stefani be fired as well? They're two and seven. I don't know. All the aging guys are to be sold. Tyron Matthew, Cam Jordan, uh, Carl G Granderson. Get Chase Young out. Right? Why are not the uh, Lions calling um old uh Saints right now about Chase Young? That that would be a good a good a good pick. Derek says he thinks the Alabama coach is getting signed to do the Saints. That would be interesting. Interesting. Kevin says, I do not like uh, Dennis Allen, but they didn't give him a chance. Two and a half years. It, it is a chance, but I don't think they had enough chance, right? Injuries this season definitely hurt, 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 hurt the Saints. We've seen what they were, they were doing. 2-0, and oh, flying high, and then all of a sudden injuries. It sucks, but I get it. And James says, bye, Kevin Stefani. Get Stefani out of here. So, guys, where no way did the Saints make a mistake by firing Dennis Allen this season. I'm saying what? I'm saying what? 